Good evening. A senior prank goes too far at a northern Kentucky high school. Now the Boone County Sheriff's Office is investigating after dozens of students broke into Ryle High School, causing serious damage. Morella Porter joins us in studio. Morella, a prank, but with some serious consequences. Yeah, absolutely, Paula. Boone County school, school leaders are taking this seriously. Students tell me the senior prank happens every year, but this time people got hurt. Some students were suspended for the last day, and the sheriff's office tells me part of their investigation will be figuring out if any of the students will face charges. School is out and the TP in the trees is the only sign of the senior prank gone bad on the last day at Ryle High School. I'm friends with some of the seniors, so they posted about it. They put like baby oils in the hallway and they put like the track hurdles. By the time I got to school, it was all cleaned up, so you couldn't really tell other than people like talking about it, like with rumors and stuff. The Boone County Sheriff's Office says 75 seniors took part in the prank. Boone County Schools says they broke in Wednesday night. While the district would not elaborate on what exactly the students did, it says the prank created potentially dangerous conditions and caused extensive damage. The school caught on with enough time to clean up before the first bell Thursday morning. The district confirms some staff were injured during the cleanup process. Not sharing much about how, but word got around quick among students. I heard that a teacher fell, like, go, going up the steps to their classroom fell. School leaders are not taking the prank lightly, with the sheriff's office investigating. I thought that was pretty crazy because, I mean, it was just a senior prank. I mean, it might have been a little bit of trespassing and vandalism, but like, they do it every year. I was shocked because I heard that they do it every year and I didn't realize that this year was that much worse. Apparently they took it a little too far and put the teachers getting hurt and stuff too. Ashton Wright says some of the seniors she knows who took part in the prank were suspended for the last day of school. The school's graduation is June 3rd. District leaders have not said if this will affect the ability to walk for students involved in the prank. There are more than 400 students in Ryle High School's senior class. Paula? And the school district says students' parents have been notified and the district is implementing an appropriate plan of disciplinary action.